Why do you think a genocide is happening in Gaza? You look at the criteria for genocide in the Genocide Convention in the UN. You look at that, you, um, you look through all the articles of it, like for example, killing people, preventing births, making, inflicting conditions of harsh lives on people that could lead to their deaths with the requisite intent to do so. Israel fits in all of that. Explain. Israel, for example, has killed like at least 30,000 Palestinians. Yeah. Israel's inflicting a massive like blockade on them, massive aid strains. We're on the brink of famine in Gaza right now, and basically millions of Palestinians are in dire, dire shortage of food. All of that brings about their destruction in the end. So let's put it this way. Uh, do we agree there is a war happening there? Because all, all what you're describing, all, Israel clearly has a war in Gaza. I completely understand. Um, the um, uh, various ports of entry to Gaza yeah. are closed right now. Yeah. And there is selective entry. But that is not by Israel alone. It's on Egypt, the side of Egypt also. So there is a war going on. So I'd, li I'd, like, yeah. to, I'd like for you to differentiate between a war and a genocide and explain to me... You can't do that, no, sorry. There's, so you you know, can, there's no difference between a war and a genocide? No, you can have war and genocide. They don't mean... It doesn't mean when you have a war, there can't be a genocide. So please, please let me know why what is happening in Gaza at the moment is not a war, but a genocide. It is a war and a genocide. But why, why war and genocide, not just a war? Because there's, because there's genocide happening. What is, so so the, what, what you're describing to me yeah. certainly would happen during a war also. Yeah, Israel has a conflict with, with uh, entities in Gaza. There is a war. That much I agree. What's that? They have a war against Palestinians, not just... They all what? Against Palestinians. Say so. They have a declared war against Hamas. Why do you think they have a declared war against Palestinians? They don't, they don't have a declared war against Hamas. Oh, so who are, hmm? who are they fighting against? Who are they fighting against? Ordinary Palestinians. Say so. Hmm? Well, what's your evidence for this? Bombing them into, like, hell. Bombing who? Palestinians. Okay, listen to me carefully. Do you know, the, do you know where the Hamas is right now? In Hamas leadership. In Plenty of... Uh, in Qatar, I've heard this a million times, but did you know that like 50% of all industry, no, not industry, sorry, infrastructure in Gaza has been bombed, as reported by the BBC? There is war happening. 90, we don't disagree. I'm, I'm a question, my question right now is, where... Do you think there is no Hamas in Gaza? I'm not saying there aren't. So how do we get them? Hmm? You, do you have a... Do you agree, first of all, like that Hamas... Like do you first of all agree Hamas are terrorists? Do you agree with that? Yeah, in their actions. Yeah, they are. Yeah. So how do we get Hamas right now? Do you have a, if you have a better military strategy, what is no, that? There is no military strategy to this. Show me one instance. So please let me know. Show me one instance where such like military strategies have brought an end to any kind of terrorist activities anywhere in the world. Uh, Iraq, Afghanistan. Those all failed horribly, ridiculously bad as well. The Taliban are now in Afghanistan and Iraq is now just a mess. I'm, I'm not sure I understand what you're saying. Let me ask you very what, simply what again. Let me, let me ask you again. Please, please, please. Let me ask again. Do you have or don't you have a strategy to capture Hamas and demolish Hamas? Do you have a strategy? Uh, no, I don't. You don't. So in other words, you can't help. You can't really help what is happening in well, Gaza. I am like a 17-year-old, so I don't think I can. Well, then, as a 17-year-old, please don't also take sides and accuse I someone of genocide. Take sides. That doesn't just because I can't directly go there and stop the genocide happening doesn't mean I can't take sides. No, no, one, no, please. We, we, oh, wow. uh, play, why, why don't you come here, please? A youngster is trying hard. Please come here. Please come. But you, uh, you're trying to. Uh, are you related? No, no. Please come. Here. So. Explain to me why what is happening in Gaza today is not a mere war, but more than that, that it is a genocide. Explain. You need to justify it because it's a serious claim. Yeah, 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 I'll tell you why. Because the killing that's happening is not just limited to the, uh, to the Hamas warriors. The proportion of the Hamas people dying, of the soldiers of Hamas dying, in comparison to the civilians, is much greater 
or the civilian uh, casualties are much greater than the actual Hamas soldiers dying. How do, how do, you, how do you get the figures? Uh, how do Hamas show up? How do Hamas show up? In military gear? No, it doesn't matter how they show up. No, it does matter. Oh, wow, wow, wow. <laughs> it does matter. Are you justifying? No, I'm asking you. I'm asking you for more details. Okay. Because you are... One second. No, one, second wait, wait, one second. Wait, 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 one second. Wait, wait, one second. You are accusing... One second. Once again... You are accusing a nation yes. of being of of committing a very serious yes. crime. Yes. Better one second, one second. Civilian. That's a serious accusation. True, you though. better back it up with evidence. So I'm asking you again. Earlier you said, earlier earlier you said a few you few Hamas operatives so killed many civilians. That's what you said. Let me ask you again. How do you identify? So how do you how do you Malachi How do you? That, that, uh, I'm talking about the war right now. Yes, so How do you identify Hamas operatives? Well, me you please let me know. Yeah, so your question is, how do we call it a genocide? What is no, no, no. That was the previous question. If you want to come in there, I can ask yeah, again. So ask ask again. again. Okay. So, I completely agree there is a war ongoing yes, in we Gaza. Both, we, both agree, we both agree on that. Yeah. But I'm assuming yeah. you are calling the war more yeah. than just a war. Yeah and as a genocide also. I completely not, disagree. I completely disagree. Okay. I, wait, one second. I completely disagree. And therefore, I'd really like to know from you what is the evidence evidence behind calling it more than a war and as a genocide. Allow me to finish, yeah? So we look at what the evidence says, we look at the intentions, we look at the ministers within the cabinet. They've called them Amalekites, wipe them out. Now in the Old Testament, you're probably you're more versed than me. Moses was called to wipe out the Amalekites. There's other ministers within the high levels of the Israeli parliament that says wipe them all out. There's other people that have said don't let them return back. Who 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 wipe who all out? The the, the Palestinians. The Palestinians yes. all out? Yes. Says who? Okay, bring the things up. There's, uh, also, there's many also, also, government also, also. ministers. No, you know, please show me one court where they say wipe out all Palestinians. Let's. Give him I'm not. I'm not into guesswork here. I'm asking you. Show one court where they are saying wipe out all Palestinians. Of Gaza, do not let them return to Gaza. Wipe out all Palestinians. Gaza, yes. Do you know what the, what the definition of phrase wipe out is? Avi Dictor, the Minister of Agriculture and Rural Development said, Hamas lost control of the north of the Strip. We're doing a Gaza Nakba 2023. Wipe out all Palestinians? Within the Gaza Strip, yes. Wipe out all Palestinians? I heard the word Hamas there. Did you hear the word Hamas there? I didn't want to Read that quote again. I heard the word Hamas there. Did you did you choose to ignore it? Tell me what the Malachites were, please. Who were the Malachites? No, no, please. I'm not. I'm. Excuse me. Excuse me. I'm not sure. I'm not sure how much of history you are aware of. So let's not. Let's not. One second. One second. One one second, please. I'm trying to speak to him. Trying to speak to him, please. Yeah. Once one one gentleman at a time, please. I'd like to know from you, sir. Yeah. Whoa, whoa, whoa. One second. One second. You said. You said. You said there is someone who said wipe out all Palestinians. Who is this? So the Israeli lawmaker Benjamin Netanyahu. Uh, Likud party has said it was becoming increasingly clear to Israelis that all Gazans, all Gazans must be destroyed. Israeli media report on Tuesday. So well, what are you reading right now? Please, can we get the source? Yeah. Is that a quote? Yes. So the new, the new Arab, the new, new, new Arab says, so Israeli lawmaker says, uh, says it's becoming clear that all Gazans must be destroyed. Says who? Says who? An Israeli, Israeli lawmaker. Who is this Israeli lawmaker? Do you know? Do you know? Do you know who this lawmaker is? Do you know who this lawmaker is? I've read it now. Once again. Read it and you'll find out. I know. I know what I'm doing. Okay, I'm asking you, do you know who Carry Netanyahu reading, is? Carry on reading. Do you know who Netanyahu is? I do yes. know. Is He's the Prime Minister. You don't know his own. You don't know his What's that? Prime Minister. Okay. Has said that it was becoming increasing, increasingly clear to Israelis that all Gazans must be destroyed. Israeli media reported Tuesday. Which media? Can we please get that? Do you want to ask? Do you want to ask? What? Okay. So, New Arab reports this. Which media? Which media says? Right, we're going back. Of the no, okay. says, there's many, the there's many quotes. Never I, which which I, media? I, you're asking me something off the cuff. 
But well, well, wait a second. I'm not asking. I'm not. I'm not asking anything off the cuff. I'm not asking anything off the cuff. Are you? Are you going away right now? You you made a serious allegation right now, and you are saying I am asking something off the cuff. So let's come back here. So you said Hamas have only a few Hamas have been killed. What did you say then? Please I didn't repeat. Say that. I wasn't here. So what what did you say? You you so came here and you said something. I didn't, I wasn't no, you said a few things. You said many civilians. Few. You from what I remember. From what I remember, many. From what I remember. Many civilians, many civilians are killed, and few Hamas operators. How do you get to that figure? Before how do you how do you find that? Before I get to the figure, how do you find that out? Are you going to let me talk? You made this statement earlier. Are you going to follow up from there or not? Are you going to follow up from the previous point? I'm going to let you talk, but please follow up from where you left off earlier. That's a, that's a very serious. Like, no, unless you're desperate. But. Okay, maybe maybe not even when you're desperate. So please let me know. What, uh, please let me know. So you are suggesting. Can I hold the mic first? I'm holding the mic. Please. Why? I'm holding the mic. Well, let me so, hold it. No, I'm Be fine. Fair. I'm. Uh, this is not about fairness. What I'm holding. You talk when you want to talk, but you don't let someone else speak. Okay. I'm going to ask the question again. If you if you if you if you want to clarify what you said earlier, you can. You but you left. Left off somewhere earlier, genocide. Yeah. You said few civilians are killed. From what I remember, you can rephrase if you want. Few civilians are killed. That's what you said. Oh, sorry, many, many. So that's uh, many civilians are killed. Few Hamas operatives. That's what I heard. From what I remember. If you want to change the narrative, you can. Okay, cool. Where where do you get your ideas from? Okay. In a, in please, can you can you please? Uh, don't touch me. My I, my camera is there. Don't touch me. My camera is there. Please. That's fine. Please. Okay, Thank you. Can I please? Yeah. Okay. Up about Do, you to, Do you have to? I'll propose the. Do you have to be? I have a, a statistics for something in order to establish that in a population, the majority of people are civilians. In a population of a of a space of a country, the majority of people are not fighters. Do you this is have speculation. To, pure speculation. Okay. Is is, is it sane? This is pure speculation. Okay. Wait, wait, let me ask you a question. Is it sane? Is it rationally? Con conceivable to p to say you have to prove to me that the majority of people in the UK are not fighters. This is pure speculation. Well, How many people? Let me ask you one oh question, please. God. Let me ask you one question, please. How many people? How many Muslims during the time of Muhammad were fighters? What kind of a question is that? Like, wait, wait, this relevant? How is this relevant? Are we living 1400 years ago? So, in other words, so let's put it this way. Okay. So you haven't provided. There were, were fighters and there wasn't. Okay. Let me ask you again, please. What um, by what? So you're purely going with speculative ideas. No, no, speculative. Is what is the proportion okay, in okay, Gaza? I'll prove to you, I'll prove what to you. what I'll is it? Let me talk. Now. No, there is no proof when there is speculation. How do? You, let me ask you a very precise question. How do you identify? How do you identify a Hamas operative when Israel gets into Gaza? How do you precisely identify a Hamas operative? Okay. Your previous question was how do you identify? Whether uh, the percentage of civilians. No, no, I moved on right now. No, no, How no, do you no, identify? No, no, you're too delayed. Majority too delayed. The question is very simple. Too delayed. Fighters. Question right now. Question right now. How do you identify a Hamas operative when you are getting into Gaza from the side of Israel? How do you identify a Hamas operative? Okay, let, let me go. For argument's sake, you can't. Look, please. For argument's sake, you can't. Okay, cool. So, in other words, in other words, your claim of genocide is failing every step of the way. Every step of the way. Well, number one, I asked you, uh, you, you said more civilians are killed, less Hamas operatives. Yeah, I asked right. you, what is the evidence? Yeah, right and you're here. going with your right speculative here. ideas. Right Excuse here. me, sir. One I second, one second, one second. One, second. one, one, one at a time. One, one at a time. One speculative idea at a time. One spec. Because one speculative idea at a time. Excuse me, sir. Do you know how conversations work? Do you know how conversations? Who is the they? I'm speaking to this gentleman. So, all right. Okay. So, number one, I asked. Thank you very much. You keep cutting me off right now. Please stay quiet. Thank you. Thank you very much. So let me let me ask you. So number one, number one. It's annoying you, isn't it? Proportion of Hamas operatives. You don't have statistic. Number one. Number two. Number two. I asked you. Number two. Number two. I asked you specifically. 
how to identify a Hamas. Wallahi, you can do whatever you want. How to identify a Hamas operative? Let me repeat this again. How do you identify a Hamas operative? Again, I'll give you one more chance. You, you, you are an older gentleman. When Israel gets into Gaza, how do you... I, please come here. If it's so easy, please come. I said it's not easy. It's not easy. But I do think Israel... How, how, how? How do you identify... Let me repeat the question. How do you identify a Hamas... It's not easy for the Israelis to do so. It's not easy. I, I, I misheard you. I thought you said so easy. So how do you so when you don't know why why is it so hard to identify Hamas operatives in Gaza? I, I don't know the full version. Sometimes they do. It's a small condensed place. From my understanding, I'm not an expert. No, no. If 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 Palestinians are so if Palestinians are so justice seeking, very friendly, it is very easy for them to give. Hamas operatives up. So let me ask you again. Why is it so hard to identify Hamas operatives in Gaza? To answer your direct question directly, from my understanding, I could be wrong. It's a small area, very condensed. There's many buildings, and it's it's a and you get operatives within that thing that hide amongst the perimeter situation. But that does not. Let me be clear. Let me ask you now. You're, you're ignoring the elephant in the room. Let me give you a simple example. Yeah. Let's say. Let's say. One second. One second. Let's say amongst us there is a murderer. And all of us know who the murderer is. All of us know because he's one of one second. One, one second. One second, please. One second, please. Excuse me, sir. Please. One of one of us is a murderer, and we all know who the murderer is. Once, excuse me, sir, and speak to the gentleman, please, 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 please. And if if the police were to come here, if the police were to come here, how easy is it for us to? Say, well, this guy is a murderer. How is it for us to do that? Aaron, we're living in a completely different... <laughs> we're living in the UK. Please give me... Stick to the example I have. If we have a number of people here, one of us is a murderer. You haven't let me finish my point. And if it is easy, we know. question. Let me just finish the answer to the last one, Aaron, with respect. Yeah. So Israel, I've got one of the most sophisticated... Um, intelligence services in the whole world, yeah? They've got, they've got Mossad and stuff. What you don't need to do, and please agree with me and tell me if this is wrong, to, to blanket bomb Muslims and Christians. Remember, there's Christians within Palestine and in the, in the Gaza Strip. To blanket bomb them and kill innocent and majority of those people are, are children. Would what's you not the, say that's wrong? What's the evidence of the blanket bombing? Video evidence. Bro, bro, have you not Video seen Gaza? Evidence. It's completely Video annihilated. Evidence. What's the evidence of indiscriminate bombing? Are you being serious? You think it's a studio, oh, you it's a studio bro? You think they've got I'll buildings speak to them. in place? Please speak. No, no, What's no, the no, evidence no, of indiscriminate no, bombing? No, no, Every single news agency. Oh forget Al Jazeera. You can look at BBC, ITV. You can see the children are dying. You've got the Gaza ministry. That is, that is, uh, the, the numbers do come from Gaza, but then Israel always confirmed generally afterwards that the numbers are there or there about. My dear friend, what's your name? Uh, I'd rather not say my name. Okay, uh, maybe I'll call you just friend. Friend, this is the problem. Yeah, You have told me there is no way to identify a Hamas operative when Israel gets in. You have, you have agreed. You said it's really hard. You said it's really hard. Number one, one, one. Let me, let me, let me. You said it's really hard. I made the point that it is very easy for the locals to really say, hey, these guys are from Hamas. Very easy to do that. Are you are you aware of any are you aware of any such excuse me? Are you excuse me? One second. Are you aware of are you aware once you have to come back to me? Come back to me. Are you aware of are you aware of why the civilians why the civilians are not Pointing to where the Hamas operatives Let's start are. Maybe that's no, okay. Why should they? Number Perhaps. one, number one, we we've got uh, they the they are the elected. We we talk about democracy. They are the elected people. Whether we like it or not in the West, they are elected. Number two, they're the people that are providing the food uh, for those innocent people. Uh, number three, the the Gaza, Gazan people, from my understanding, this is not a one-off. They've been regularly bombed. What happens is when you regularly bomb people, they're going to go to those who's those that there are going to be some people that do become. Now you're expanding the scope of the discussion right now. I'm asked you. I asked you a very simple question. It doesn't matter whether you did not. You did not. You gave a reply, but it wasn't an answer to the question I asked. I asked the question. 
it is very easy regardless one second it is very easy when when the army wants to get in it is very easy for guards and court and court civilians to say these are hamas operatives to identify to pinpoint so it, why is not why is that not easy we don't know if, if you may not know no, no. they know how do you know they know how do you know well they, they're part of the okay you tell me so you do are you there's saying are you saying one second are Arun, you saying Aaron there's terrorists here in this country we don't know who they are Hamas aren't terrorists for Gazans they are the ruling elected people they know who are bearing arms every family knows who are taking up arms to live every day so please please don't compare them against terrorists in the Western world so let me ask you let me let me ask you again let me ask you why aren't the civilians why aren't the civilians exposing 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 Oh Why did you push him away? Why are you taking over? In other words, in a, are you saying you can't answer the question? Are you saying you can't answer the question right now? Why? Do you know of one? Show me the evidence. Do you? Do you? Show me the evidence. I'll come. I'll come in a minute. But before that, before that, let me. Before, be, excuse me, sir. Before that, let's wrap up what we spoke about. Do you know of one? incident no, no, that's fine no thank you very much do you know of excuse me sir i am refusing to engage with you because you i believe will not engage with the questions i have asked do you know of one incident do you know of one incident where civilians where civilians have given up hamas operatives do you know one incident can, can, can you show me evidence where everybody knows that every single person who has signed up to now that's what the question asked do you know of do you know of one you prove that. Prove it now. do you know of one I'm coming there I'm coming there I'm really coming there in other words in other words you are advocates without a clue that's who you are do we, okay if your kids then stay away then let me let me speak to an adult here if you are no such so uh, can we please quickly agree because it's a fact from what we understand that there is no incident so far in my awareness of civilians handing over Hamas operatives even though it is very easy I don't know, I don't know. Okay. You but, know but 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 you have you have you have but once once once, once but but you have suggested despite not knowing very basic facts and despite agreeing it is really hard to get to identifying Hamas very very hard you are accusing Israel of various things before accusing you at least need to get to know some details let me ask you now again you can try but I like to see you know Israel do infiltrate Hamas and they do work within the Palestinian people yeah this is known by Mossad yeah so they work so they can identify those people and in fact in some instances they have identified people and have targeted them for me if you want to target the, the thing those people who have abducted those poor innocent people within Israel target them but don't blanket bomb but we agreed we agreed already it is very hard it's to not. identify Hamas. We, you said it's you not said not it's really hard okay. didn't you say this okay okay let me ask you no i did i did oh but 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 i also clap but but to qualify what i'm saying is it's not right aaron and i'm sure as a man of the bible and as someone that preserves life and that believes in love to blanket bomb innocent people that's that a serious that accusation you're repeating despite agreeing despite agreeing oh despite God, agreeing earlier not in my knowledge okay. it really no, not not in my knowledge not in my knowledge in my i'll describe i'll describe uh, one second my friend i'll describe <laughs> Excuse me, sir. You're either children or you're not children. Choose one of them. Either you're going to engage or you're not going to engage. Because when I ask them questions, they are saying, "Yeah." Why do you think that there isn't blanket bombing? I'll, 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 I'll describe to you what I see is happening. Very good. In my view, Hamas have perpetrated one of the heinous acts against the nation of learn to listen my dear friends <coughs> against the nation of israel we'll come to that later come to that. <coughs> one of the most heinous acts israel has to respond and israel has to find a solution 
of making sure this does not repeat. Israel has to do that. Now, you might think you, ha you have a better strategy. I'd like to come there in a little bit. But for now, just to respond to your pre the question you asked, very simply put, in my view, it is rather really hard. It is very easy to maybe identify a few top officials of Hamas. But even then, it is really hard to find out where they are hiding. And it is, it is, it is almost impossible for them to be hiding without external support. Now, but that's one difficulty. But there are thousands and thousands of Hamas operatives who are, you know, ordinary operatives and it will be really, really hard for Israel to find out, even with the extreme level of intelligence that Mossad has. So in my view, they are faced with the situation where they need to... Uh, this is your lie. You did not have statistics, please. Excuse me. Let, let, let your elders speak, please. Let your... Yeah. So, so in my view... In my view... Yeah, but but let me let me make it very very I clear. Like the biblical teaching of turn the other cheek, I, I have like that love for the, 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 the and that have legal. The but just to, to blanket. I, did you not start by talking about genocide? Did you say this or not? I I, I believe it is a genocide. So let's yes. let's stay with that topic rather than let's stay I with believe, that. I'm let's, not the only one. I believe there's many Israelis that support me within that. Doesn't matter. Uh, look, uh, truth isn't determined by truth isn't determined by who agree. believes what. Truth is determined by the evidence, and, the evidence is there. and, and this is where I asked you multiple questions so far. I asked you what is the evidence for genocide. And, and we gave you the, the quotes from the uh, leaders as well. We showed you some from the Arab news. It's from the Arab news, and they they are stating they did not quote a particular source. They said Israel news. We know. We need, we need to now. We need to make progress. We need to make progress. Let me let me ask you this very simply, please. Among the Muslims, let's quote. Let's let's for a recap for people. We've we've given quotes of people like Benjamin Atta, who's the commander in chief. You did not give a quote. You did not give a quote. Excuse me. You. No no. Wait a second. Wait a second. Wait a second. I asked you. I asked you. There's many people within that. I asked you. I asked you. I I I asked you in particular whether there is appetite among Israeli leadership that um, they are going to wipe out all Palestinians, which is your claim. You claim that without evidence. We quickly, we quickly, we quickly, we quickly, we quickly got to the bottom. Please, my dear friend, please, you speak to me. Please don't, please don't be distracted. Uh, so, so, to move the conversation Move the conversation. have Israeli Please, we need to seek, we need to get to the details right now. So, number one, we agreed on this. And number two, we said, number two, we said, uh, that it is very hard to identify who Hamas operatives are. We, we, we agree. We agree. Let me ask you a very simple question right now. Let me ask you, what do you think Israel should do? To wipe out Hamas, what do you think Israel should do? What I, let's start off. What I no, we're not talking about Islam right now. I'm asking him. And I'm not asking you for your Islamic strategy. I'm not asking you for your Islamic strategy. Islamic strategy is that not interested right now. I'm asking you, what do you think Israel, Israel must do? Okay. Let's start off with what they shouldn't do. What they shouldn't do is you're please, please, let him speak. Number. Don't so touch me, please. Let me, let me, let, please, please. No, but, let him speak. Imagine but no one. Here and you will get bombed. Is that yes. Yes. No, but yeah, absolutely. But we, what we shouldn't do is bomb uh, people. Jews, Christians, uh, Palestinians. They, remember, Palestinians aren't just Muslims, yeah? So you're not getting those strategy, please. In the interest of time, so please give me a strategy. We shouldn't bomb them. If you should be patient, number one, do do your research, find out. Go, Mossad can go in, they can infiltrate, they can find the leadership if they need to, and they can have it one on one. They can go in there and they can do targeted killings as the US and the British forces have done in the past. Who are the Hamas? I'm a little bit confused right now. Okay. Is the Hamas only 10 people or who are the Hamas? Um, the thousands, hundreds of thousands. Hundreds of thousands. We're talking about hundreds of thousands. I'm asking you, I'm asking you, I'm asking you, I'm asking you, how does, how does, what should the strategy for Israel be? To take, to, one second, I'm speaking to him. Please. How, how, one second, please focus, please. How should Israel, how should Israel 
deal with the hundreds and thousands of these Hamas operatives. Agree, there's hundreds of thousands of well, if you don't Hamas agree, other, if you don't reality, agree on a simple fact, I don't think we can have a sensible there's conversation. No How many are there? Please let me know. How many are there? The reality is that we don't know. No, you tell me. You, 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 you tell me. What is your prediction? What's your prediction? Hamas rules over Gaza. What's your prediction? I'm going to let you, so you're going to ask me a question. What's your prediction? Aaron, let me speak, yeah? So, but you need to give me an answer. What's the prediction of how many Hamas operatives exist? Move the mic away. So I, to answer your question directly, no one knows how many uh, Hamas operatives they are. No, no, we don't. Number two, but what we do know is every time you bomb them and every time you do these military campaigns, it increases their popularity. No, it doesn't matter. You, you, you to, I, I don't care. You don't have a strategy. And I'm really sad. I'm real. Look, look, look. One second. Do you do you think Israel should survive? Please no, let me know. No. I think Israel have absolutely a right. To and survive. therefore, let's do it. I believe. I, I value Jewish life. I value Christian life. I value Muslim life. Very good. Very good. So Jewish is an ethnicity. I don't know why you're confusing religion with that. Okay. Jewish life. We agree. So please, please, please. One second. One second. Please put yourself in the shoes of. Jewish leadership today, the leadership does not matter. Just because you have Jewish friends, it doesn't mean you're making sense. Please tell me, please tell me, please tell me, give me one good strategy for the nation of Israel to deal with the hundreds and thousands of Hamas operatives sticking. Are you saying there? How many are there? How many Hamas operatives are there? How many Hamas operatives are there? Can we agree there's not hundreds of thousands? How many are there? Hamas operatives? How many are there? No, well, listen, we can't speculate. How many are there? We don't need to. We don't. If we don't know, we don't know. How many are there? Guess. We don't know. Guess. Guess. Because I don't know. Two. That's what you do. Ten. Hundred. Tell us. So, let me, let me, in other words, can I, okay, okay, so, okay. We do know. Every time, every time you bomb Palestinians, can I give you? If someone bombed and killed my okay. mom, I would want to annihilate them. Okay, good. My dear friend, my, my dear friend, once and once and once. So you are saying you don't want, excuse me, excuse me, sir. You are saying you don't know how many Hamas operatives are there. Once again, excuse me, sir, I'm, I'm speaking to you. My dear young friend, please, I'm speaking to you. How many you don't know? You don't know, yeah? So how do you know? Time. One second. Don't you don't know how many are there. So why do you think most of the people who are killed today are civilians when you don't know how many Hamas operatives are there? I do know from my understanding is Israel actually funded Hamas when it was... When it irrelevant, irrelevant. We're talking about... Wow, 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 irrelevant. Irrelevant. You're just bringing in... You're just bringing in more rabbit holes so you can hide somewhere very, very deep. So far, in many, many questions I've asked, you haven't got to the bottom of any question, my dear friend. I'd really like you to get to the bottom of at least some questions somewhere. Please, let me ask you again. When you don't know, because to me that's very, very, to me, to me, to me, to me, to me. When you don't know how many are there, Let's uh, at least not be one second. At least, at least, don't be hypocritical when you don't know how many are there, how many Hamas operatives are there. How would you ever get to know what proportion of who are killed are civilians versus Hamas operatives? So, so your, I think your question centers around strategy. No, 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 my, so no. I'm talking to you right now. You have accused a nation of genocide. And for that, for you, for your accusation, one of the important points you brought up was that many civilians. Few Hamas operatives is okay. part of the storyline. Okay. I'd like to find out so, if you don't know who you, are who are Hamas operatives, so, how do you know what is the percentage of Hamas operatives who are killed? Listen, I'm saying there is certainly some people that Hamas operatives that are killed. But how many? How many? How much? What's the percentage? Please, the rough percentage. Amount, the large amount, the stats say, is mainly children that have died. No, 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 please. I'm not. I, excuse me. I don't want you to. Uh, excuse me. My dear friend, my dear friend. I don't think you're being I don't. I don't. You haven't given any. Any meat to I chew was, on, right? Yeah, so far. I I so far, I no meat to chew on. How to identify a Hamas operative? No answer. Who told you that all Gazans must be wiped out by an Israeli leader? Not, not the quote you gave, some random weird uh, source there. Number one, number two, no answer. No quote, no quote from a neutral source. Number three, what is a good, one second. No, what is a good strategy to 
take over Hamas, no answer. How many Hamas, I know, how many Hamas operatives are there? No answer. What is the proportion of the Hamas operatives who have been killed? No answer. My dear friend, can I please recommend something? We do, are you a Muslim yourself? I am a Muslim. On Wednesdays, we do live streams. Uh, absolutely. Because I think you are a sensible man. I'd really get to the bottom of many things that we have spoken of right now. Operation, once, once. I am a very genuine man. It's really hard to stay on focus. You you try to stay on focus and at least answer some of the questions very honestly. So I really appreciate what you've done so far. Only, only at the end, I think you made things up and you even gave a strategy to your friend. But Wednesday, 8 p.m., I'm we do London. Try not to get people. I was saying to people, don't get triggered. Let's yeah. have a sensible conversation. Absolutely. That's a good point. And, and let's, bro, you're Christian. I'm Muslim. Let's just people for the. Let's pray for the innocent people. Absolutely. Would you agree completely with that? agree? You innocent lives for, being lost is a Jewish, tragic Christian, affair. Muslim, wherever they are, let's all pray for them. And let's just. But why do you innocent think, lives let's, being let's lost is a tragic yeah, thing? Of course it is. I want it the has war. To be felt. It has to be felt. I want the war heart, to get to an end. I want the war. Believe it or not, I want the war to get to an end. ASAP but the frank reality that I find is Hamas still are at large and this is this is my problem and like you rightly said you don't have a strategy to deal with this in which case Israel has a huge issue still so can we please catch up Wednesday 8 p.m. YouTube operation Stephen Stephen with the PH could I could I expect you there I think there's Just some football, football. and I'm a football fan. So. What's that? I'm a football fan, so I think there's, uh, it's to do with the Premiership title race. Don't, don't worry, don't worry. But if not, speak to someone with probably a bit more knowledgeable than me. I'm not the most knowledgeable the on this. The problem is this. When you're not knowledgeable, you should no, not pick right. sides. I have enough knowledge. I still this feel like, I still feel like, like if people watch the video back, they'll see the ludicrous arguments that you made. And with respect, and they'll see who was right. People could check the references. You can't be right or wrong without stats, without statistics. And this, yeah. You know but lovely see seeing you. God, God's blessings. I'd really look forward to more details later, more conversation later.